All right, this is True Patriot 09, and just wanted to uh, do another review. Um, this is uh, something that I have tested, and uh, just wanted to do, uh, like I said, a quick review and give my thoughts on it. Um, it's a Halo. <clears throat> it's a rangefinder. Uh, actually, picked it up from a local pawn shop. Uh, local pawn shop I go to uh, they also have a gun shop inside they also sell guns on gun broker at relentless tactical uh, that's the name they go under uh, on gun broker uh, a lot of good good guys that work there a really really nice clean uh, pawn shop and they happen to have this I'd ask them about it they had done um, you know of course they they had done their homework and figured out how much it was um, you know uh, they give me an excellent price on it, and it ranges out to uh, 500 yards. Uh, it's got a couple of different modes. You can um, see the power button there, and then the mode button. It, uh, it it reads in meters, yards. It also scans as well. Uh, it's got the focus, which the lens back here turns, um, and it focuses. Uh, it's got a nice little uh, square on the inside of it, which... I will try, and I have a feeling it's not going to work. Yeah, I, I can never get it to work. But uh, anyway, uh, when you look through it, uh, you actually see. Um, we'll try one more time. And you can see a little bit of it there. And basically, it's got that little bitty square that you can see inside. And. Uh, what it does is, is you put that on there it's got the laser on the front uh, on the bottom there that shines out uh, you look through the top part which is the, uh, the scope part of it and when you look through it uh, you range out your distance like I said it goes up to 500 yards what I've done is I've actually went to uh, our police range and tested it out there so I know what yardage is what um, I was I was basically marking some yardage uh, up there at uh, some targets and I ranged everything from um, about a hundred yards to it was about 217 272 300 and some yards and I ranged out to 400 and some change uh, in yardage and uh, you know not holding it in the same exact spot every time but going back and standing in uh, in or around the same spot I was at and ranging it again and it was off by maybe a yard or so which there again I'm not going to stand in the same exact spot every single time and range the same exact thing so when I went back to rearrange stuff again at the same spots at the targets that were stationary uh, and then I went back to the spot that I was at it was it was it was really close it was within a yard or so uh, and I've been fairly impressed with it. Um, it's it's relatively clear, uh, you know. It's waterproof and things like that. Uh, it's really, really, really lightweight. Uh, it takes one CR one two three battery. Uh, it automatically shuts off. Um, you actually hit the power button. Once you hit the power button, it comes on. Uh, you put the little square uh, on whatever it is that you want to range. Hit the power button again, uh, one click, and it basically ranges it. If you hit the mode button, there again you can switch from yardage to meters or you can go to scan. Uh, in the scan mode, uh, which I haven't messed a lot, messed around with it a lot, but when you hit the scan mode you go from uh, whatever point you want to the next point and it sits there and it, and it scans and, and does the yardage that way. So uh, my thoughts on it, it's made by Wild Game Innovations. I also have one of their um, uh, game cameras and when I get a chance um, I'm gonna take the game camera out um, maybe a little bit later in April and put it up on the farm and actually turn it to video now the wild game innovations cam uh, game cam that I have I got it off of Amazon and it's a compact really tiny I've already used it some and it takes great pictures uh, bunch of different modes you can use uh, things like that but wild game innovations um, makes this particular rangefinder it works really well uh, I'll do a review on the game camera uh, once I get some better footage and just kind of show you uh, you know I know I'll get footage from 
uh, the day at night things like that but just a really good game uh, really good game camera but this rangefinder is really good if you find one um, and you want and you want to get an inexpensive rangefinder that works really well uh, I would definitely go with the halo worked great for me so far um, and I'll give another update uh, here in a couple of months um, and to let you all know I am getting like I said another live free armory AR-15 should be here tomorrow according to uh, relentless tactical and the 300 blackout upper should be here either Friday, this Friday, or next Monday. So I'll do a review on that once I get it. So this is True Patriot 09. Thank you all for watching. Thank you to my subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Uh, I'll, I'll continue to put videos up. And uh, please leave comments on things maybe you'd like to see, uh, things you'd like to see me do, maybe things you'd like to see me not do anymore. Um, I, I take constructive criticism very well. So thank you for watching True Patriot 09. Um, let's just thank our first responders. Let's thank our military. Let's pray for them and their families and their safety. And let's just pray for this nation. This is True Patriot 09. Thank you for watching.